Hi, this is Inform TV. Today for Black History Month, I want to focus a case. I'm at the Greyhound bus station. Uh, let's talk about Sergeant Isaac Woodard. Um, February the 12th, 1946, Sergeant Isaac Woodard returned of, to the U.S. from fighting in World War II. He was on a Greyhound bus and en route to his home, he requested that the bus driver in Winsboro, South Carolina stop at a rest stop so he could get a bathroom break. Uh, the driver refused, the uh, arguments and started. So the Greyhound bus driver threw him off the bus at the next stop. When Sergeant Woodard got, Woodard got off the bus, uh, the police and the police chief of the next town was waiting for him. They arrested him, they attacked him, they beat him so bad until he was unconscious. Uh, Sergeant Woodard, he was, had his eyes gouged out, had his eyes gouged out, Billy Club. Uh, there was a trial. All people involved in the trial, of course, they were acquitted and they kept their jobs. And so this incident may have started to help ignite the civil rights movement. Sergeant Woodard, uh, people rallied around him. Orson Welles, radio announcer, he put this, uh, gave this case publicity and a benefit was given uh, for uh, Sergeant Woodward, Woodard and Billy Holiday and uh, Joe Lewis, the fighter, the boxer, gave a, a benefit in Harlem and raised thousands of dollars. President Truman, that was the beginning of him integrating the armed forces after this case drew so much attention. And Sergeant Woodard said that he just couldn't believe that he fought for his country to be to come back to be treated so bad and so horribly. So I'm remembering paying tribute to Sergeant Isaac Woodward. Um, this is Inform TV 100. I'm at a Greyhound bus station to pray for Sergeant Woodard and uh, tribute to him. I'm very sorry of what he had to what he had to endure. His last interview was in 1982 where he said that he just well oh, he didn't have any bitterness he just is hoping that things change uh, for the better he also went on a speaking tour uh, with the NAACP to tell people about his experience and what had happened to him so there is a history of brutal that type of brutality in certain places. It was common during that time and nothing was ever, it was considered normal uh, during that time. And did still have, have that same type of behavior and in some states more than others. Uh, this is Inform TV. We would like to uh, pay tribute to Sergeant Isaac Woodard, 
who fought for his country and he came back and was blinded unfairly and beaten by the police because of the color of his skin. Ironically, uh, before they beat him, they asked him if he was discharged and he told them yes. And that's when they proceeded to, to beat him even more. There is a special on PBS that covers um, this story. Uh, let's pray and take a moment of silence for Sergeant Wood, Isaac Woodard. Thank you. This is Inform TV. God bless you. Happy Black History Month. Uh, we pray for you. We love you. Get your checkups. Get your tests. And uh, and God bless you. Uh, have a wonderful day. Be good to yourself as well as others. And in signing off, as I say all the time. The great Joe Madison said, when confronting a problem, what are you going to do about it? What are you going to do about it? God bless you. Inform TV 100. Bye for now.